we're going to introduce four new dogs to the two German Shepherds, the two young German Shepherds. Now, they're not going to be the problem. German Shepherds aren't going to be the problem. These three, not the little one, these three are going to be the problem, especially this one. It's going to be probably too rough, too on them. So what I want to do is I want to train these dogs that these dogs don't want to be played with roughly. Can we just let, we can train a dog to not play too rough with another dog, right? They're nervous. This dog has to recognize they're nervous and play gently with them. So I'm going to back up these two dogs, especially Charlie, the male German Shepherd. If he's like, please don't play with me, I'm going to go, don't play with him. Is that mean to this dog? No. This dog can be as rough as it wants with this dog. That dog cannot be as rough as it wants to that one. Kind of like the Bulldog and the German Shepherd video I did a few, like six months ago. You, the Bulldog was playing fine, but the other dog didn't want to be played with that way. Can your kid go play rough with every kid just because he can play rough with one of his friends? No. Okay, we're going to go in here. Come on, guys. Claire. Okay, go, 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 go. Here they go. They're, they're checking out the dogs. Look at Charlie. He's like, what's going on? Claire's meeting them. Good. They're, they're hesitant. These, these two German Shepherds, they've got to live life. they got to meet dogs. they got to do things. they got to smell things. they got to run around. But dogs, they don't want to be overwhelmed by dogs. Look at him smelling the air. It's the most dogs he's ever met. And her. And her. <clears throat> so they're doing good. It's getting dark. Yeah, she's doing good. Look at, look at over here. A little overwhelmed. I got to tell Moose, you can't chase her. Can't chase her. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, that wasn't bad. He barely ran up to her. He was just being a dog, and she ran away. These are, these are, these are dogs that, look at her pant, okay, her panting. These are dogs, it's not warm out here. These are dogs, I told you in the last video, or the video before the last one, these are, they need to live life. Is three or four super nice dogs too much for them? No, we're playing catch up. They're nine months old and they're totally unsocialized. And they're a little stressed and they're a little fearful. Four nice dogs is not bad. We're playing catch up. They gotta, they gotta live life. We gotta fast track this thing. Oh good. He likes Prince. And Prince is doing play bows. Prince is doing play bows, which is the perfect thing to say, hey, we're friends, right? Oh here, play bow. Good. And he's playing. Prince! So that's what I was talking about. Relax. That's what I was talking about, right? I'm training him, my helper dog, to adjust his play to the dogs. I want to train her to adjust her play to the... Claire! We'll do this all day. Claire! We are, I am training every dog here to adjust its play to the other dogs. Is it unfair? Yeah, it's not unfair. Is it a lot to ask? Yes, it's a lot to ask. Claire's pretty young. She's got to read the dog. Prince, leave it. She's got to read the dog and perfectly play with the dog. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're expecting a lot. That's what we're doing. We're training. That's training. Are we going to finish it with Claire? No. Should I be able to finish it with my dog? Yes. He should be almost there. And he was. He chased one of them. I said, Prince, and then I just said, calm down. It was my body language that chilled him out. I was like, looked at him, kind of did my hands like this. Just like people, dogs read your body language, right? If you're like, calm down, they get it, the tone of things. I'm, a, I'm training every dog here to play with these two German Shepherds differently than they play with Prince. Okay, was that too much from Moose? No, Moose did a little play bow in his face. He is softer with dogs. She, with, with people. He's nervous of people. She's nervous of dogs. He's actually pretty good with dogs. She's actually pretty good with people. They have it flipped. Their fear is 
flipped. So that is a video on introducing nervous dogs to a group, training your dog or other dogs to be chill around, around other dogs. So if, if they're too much for a dog, you make a noise and you tell the dog calm down or you go grab the dog. Train a dog to adjust its play to the other dog's play preference. All right, you can do that. We can, you can do it with kids. Why can't you do it with a dog? It's actually, you have to do it with kids. We can also do it with dogs. It takes time though. Prince is almost there. Claire, one of these other board and train dogs, it's a little tougher. That's your video.